This episode of Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater is brought to you by Feature Points, Get Free Gift Cards, Games, and much more. Try free apps, get rewards. Go to your iOS or Android browsers and type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash F E A T U dot R E forward slash V G O. Use the app, start reaping the rewards. Video Gamers Oasis dot com play. Subscribe. Greetings gamers, welcome back to Ben Jordan case number 5. Ben Jordan Paranormal Investigator, Land of the Rising Dead. We're continuing our adventure with a uh, special supernatural murder mystery in Japan. Let's continue back, uh, we're in day, day 2 now. So we're back in the hotel, Ben Jordan's here. Ben Jordan, Paranormal Investigator. It's kind of surprising you're still doing this thing, this for a living. Small television rot is on the dresser. You really don't have time to watch television right now. You can't see any drawers on the dresser. Let's go up to the bathroom and see what's in there. Go to the bathroom. We're trying to get to the bottom of what, what, what all this, what's going on with all these mysterious murders of businessmen in Japan. There's a newspaper. It's a considerate of the hotel to provide the day's newspaper for entertainment while in the bathroom. The paper is dated October the 25th. Once again, you can't make heads or tails of anything on the front page. Suddenly, your eye is drawn to a photo of Mr. Shinobi on the bottom of the page. Hmm, maybe I should pay him a visit today. Alright, that might be a good idea. Alright, there's nothing else to do around the bathroom. Now my prop, my, how's my, um, uh, stationery, my, uh, objects. It's a large black robe you assume belongs to Simon, which you took from your bathroom, and without asking, you had better know what to do, you're going to do with it. The robe feels like it's made of silk. Signed by Inspector Yoshi, which you took from the police station bulletin board. The crime scene kit should help with the more scientific research you may need to do. You open up the crime scene kit to find a set of tools for taking fingerprints and a syringe. Alright, that's going to be useful. This set includes a brush, black fingerprinting, dust, and tape for collecting fingerprints. You don't want to mess around with the kit unless you intend to take fingerprints. Alright, save our progress. Let's uh, visit Mr. Shinobi again. Save progress. Let's head on out. Go to the to the uh, CEO of Shinobi Corp. See what's going on there. Shinobi. Oh, what's going on here? Huh? Inspector Yoshi, what are you doing here? Is everything okay? No, Mr. Jordan. I'm afraid everything is not quote unquote okay. I'm sure you have read today's newspaper. Well, sort of. I mean, I noticed Mr. Shinobi's picture on the front page. Wait a minute. Has Shinobi been... Come with me. Dun, dun, dun. Oh my god. Pretty gruesome, isn't it? Not to mention elaborate. When, this, when did this happen? As far as we've been able to determine, sometime bef between last night and early this morning, around 6 a.m., 
do you mind if I have a look around? I suppose not, just make sure you don't touch anything. Inspector Usually looks like a man with a lot on his mind. His expression is serious, his skin pale. You guess he hasn't slept in, in, in for a while. Some places to have people around. Are you alright? You look a little pale. I dislike crime scenes, Mr. Jordan. Even though I see things like this almost every day, I've never been able to get used to it. Could I ask you a few couple questions? Go ahead. How did you find the body? It wasn't us. It was Mr. Shinobi's secretary. I didn't even know he had one. In fact, I thought security in the building was kind of lacking. It really isn't surprising that someone or something could have snuck in here and killed Shinobi. According to her secretary, the secretary, Shinobi phoned her last night and asked her to check up on him this morning. When she did, she found him dead and called us. Weird. It's almost like Shinobi knew he was going to die. Perhaps he did. Unfortunately, we can't ask him now. Okay, that's a little bit of a clue there. So Shinobi... You still have no idea who could be doing all these murders? Not a clue, unfortunately. You know, I spoke about, uh, with Mr. Shinobi yesterday, and he seemed convinced that the title of quote-unquote ghost murders was inaccurate. Is that so? Yes, he seemed to believe that the real culprits were the living dead. You don't say. Zombies. I, I, I know it's kind of difficult to believe, but... Do you think it's possible that zombies could be involved? As I said before, Mr. Jordan, I am not a believer in things related to the paranormal. However, at least a zombie is a physical being that is a form that can be traced and therefore would be easier for someone to fake than a spirit. So you think someone could be acting like a zombie while doing these murders? No, I don't, but it's a far less plausible theory than the first one. Uh, right. Tell me about yourself. Is it hard being a detective and having to see all this murder and death on a regular basis? Well, it certainly isn't easy. Some people eventually became, com become completely jaded. They don't make for very good company. I can imagine they don't. Thanks. Uh, murder victim. Shinobi doesn't look very good. Of course, that's probably due to the fact that he has a katana protruding from his back. It would be a it wouldn't be a good idea to disturb the body. You should disturb the evidence. Let's examine the sword. Uh Save our progress. You begin to admire the view from Shinobi's window, but soon realize it's just a painting. Okay. It's a long katana with an elaborately carved handle, used to impale Mr. Shinobi. Okay. Anything else? Looks like the Abor Shark painting. Okay. Nothing else to do here. Progress. Ask you a few questions. Go ahead. Thanks. All right. I think I think this we just just about everything we could do here. Let's get moving. Anything in the trash can? You better get things dig into the trash. Nothing in the trash. Gonna do the plant. Okay. Let's get going. You press the button to call the elevator. Ding. Jeez, what a grisly sight.